Okay, here's another unique advantage to uh, running server power supplies as opposed to uh, some of your other power supplies that only have a single output. A lot of them only have a single output. It's gonna be your 12 or 13, 14, 15, whatever you, you set it to. And you run them all in parallel. So I just have these taped together for now, but you run them in parallel. So your voltage is gonna stay the same on every one. You have no idea of when you got a power supply that goes out. So both of these power supplies have their output. They also have a three volt and a five volt output. You can hook an LED up to that. There's your three volt, a little bit brighter on five volt. So how would you know when one of those power supplies went bad on you? You don't. On, a, on some of the other ones you buy, you, you, you just don't. They don't have any other outputs. I'm gonna unplug this top one. So I unplug this power supply. Now it's hooked up in parallel with this power supply here. So it's still gonna show you a voltage on there but the power supply is not working, so there's no three volt output, there's no five volt output. What you're gonna do is you're gonna, you're gonna take a, a LED and however many power supplies you decide you wanna run in the cabinet, two, four, six, eight, however many, you're gonna put a LED on every single one of them and put it in the front of your cabinet corresponding to which power supply it's on. That way, when this power supply, whichever one goes bad, you're gonna know that that power supply crapped out on you. You're gonna know it just by looking at it quick, like, oh, I got a power supply out. Otherwise, you're not gonna know. You're, you're gonna keep dropping power supplies and you wonder why you're not getting, you know, your voltage is gonna be the same, but you're gonna, you can't figure out why your amp's not getting the output or or what's going on. I'll show you the front of mine over here. Let me get this camera out of this holder here. So this is my station a little bit here, but this is my power supply here. I have six power supplies in there and each one of them LEDs correspond with how it's exactly laid out inside there. So if I have a L this LED here go out, why well, know that bottom power supply that's in this corner down there took a crap on me? And that's the, that's the best way I know of doing it. It's, it. it's better than some of the other power supplies you get running out there, which you, know, you have six of them in the cabinet and you have no idea that any of them went out. That's what I would suggest.